It is so warm today. Whatever can I do? Why, I think I'll fire up that grill and make some cheeseburgers. Miss Rooster, do you like cheeseburgers? Yeah, you like cheeseburgers. You like cheese and you like burgers. You like cheeseburgers. Yeah, that's all. Daddy's going to make some. He'll make one for all of you guys. Let's get started. Yeah, look at you. Uh. All right, folks, we're going to mix up some hamburgers. Actually, cheeseburgers. First thing I'm going to do is take about this much. And my hands are thoroughly washed. You can tell because I'm holding them like that. That's how you know. I'm going to put the rest of this in the bowl. Now, listen carefully to what I put in here. Zesty Italian. Put a little squirt in there. Gives it a little zing. Worcestershire. A couple squirts. Well, that dude's about gone. Thank well, Just enough, though. Put this over that. And. I'm going to put a little old spoon of that minced garlic in there. I'm going to put two eggs in there. Now this is from Eggland's Best. Check this egg out. See how that egg looks? Now, an egg from one of my hens. Oh, much better color than that. Actually, there really isn't. And for the final ingredient. Yeah, you're going to... You're going to go, what? Mustard. Put a little squirt of mustard in there. That's right. In the meat. Then you get your meat hooks in there and squish it all up together. And that is cold stuff, man. Mix it up real good. And you're like, why'd you take that big hunk of meat out there and put it separate? Well, that's for my dogs. They don't get garlic or onions or any of that in there. And this is too soupy, but we'll make do with it. Mm, cheeseburger. All right, we'll let that set a while. I'm gonna go fire up the grill. All right, we're gonna light this grill, grill up. I've got some instant match light in here. And then I've got some of these chunks here. I, I just like the way them sound when they're burning. Oh, tell me this stuff won't, ain't gonna light. Never buy the cheap charcoal. Ah, it don't wanna light. And I used all my lighter fluid. Good Lord. Well, I've got another bag of it. That must be the old one. Put a few of these in there to get it started. If you got a gas grill, don't bother making my cheeseburgers because you ain't gonna get a real flavor. Got to have a charcoal grill, man. If you got a gas grill, you might as well put them in a frying pan in the house and set off your, your smoke alarms. Cause they ain't no good on a gas grill. They just ain't. Now right, let's let that burn a while. Having a gas grill is kind of like owning a Yugo. With these grates over here. I'm gonna go in and write a cheeseburger song because these cheeseburgers are gonna be so good they're going to deserve its own song. And then I've got a couple pieces of hickory soaking in the water over here. All right. Be back when the burgers go on. All right. We got the coals ready. You know how you can tell? Ow! That's how you know. I'm going to put the dog's burgers on. You're like, you're giving your dog's burgers? Hey, if I could afford it, they would eat raw meat every day. It's good for them. And there's my burgers. Boogers, rather. Mm. 
that's how you know it's hot enough here that sizzling. Look at her. And you want the cheapest, greasiest ground beef you can buy. So the burger needs to be greasy. Alright. Yeah, there's a good. I wrote a song about it, folks. Hello, cheeseburger. Where have you been? Been craving your greasiness since I don't know when. Dribble down my beard. I'll wear it like a charm. Mustard stain on my arm is a tattoo all of them up my arm. Boy, I messed that last verse up. Oh, well. It's called mustard stain as a tattoo all up and down my arm. All right, let's let them cook. You cannot burn a burger, but the dogs I'm gonna cook very rare. Well, let's see what we got. All right. I'm just gonna move them. Get those marks on there. If you're one of them people that put tin foil on your grill grates, shame on you. You don't do that. Look at them little doggy burgers. They're gonna love life tonight. It's actually, don't wanna cook them too much for them. All right, we'll come flip them here in a minute. Chicken's got a tomato. It was all mushy. I wasn't going to eat it. Y'all got mud and crap all over it. They're still eating it. They don't care. They're chickens. Waddles, you, oh, you got the other slice of tomato. Yep. They love tomatoes, and they're good for them. Any vegetable or fruit is good for chickens. But they won't eat lemons or limes. Now, let's give my burgers a flip. Not quite ready. There you go. And you like them to catch on fire like that. That's good. I'm gonna move these dudes over here. These are sad looking. Made them too mushy. That's all right. They're gonna have flavor. Get that fire on them a little bit. Fire. Big old greasy burgers. Mm. Look at that. Fire grilled burgers. Ain't you hungry? You will be when you see the ones I'm building. Cheese burgers. Cheese burgers. Now that song's gonna be stuck in your heads all week. Right, they're almost done and I only toast the bottoms of the buns and the reason for that is if you toast the tops you go to eat your burger it all breaks apart and you got yourself a mess it's too much out and the way you check to see if the bread's too dry is when you're in the store you stick your thumb through it through the package it bounces back it's good bread you put that package back on the shelf and get another one and the store will end up throwing that package out and poor people will come digging a dumpster the next day and they'll have free bread so that's how you do that all right <laughs> i'm gonna attempt to open a cheese package live i don't have anything but swiss cheese It'll work. Cheese is cheese, man. Get on there. Now we have cheese burger. Right, I gotta move them quick. And yes, the dog's gonna get some cheese. Get over here. pepper jack cheese shredded but it'll melt a little for me 
a little more for me. A little bit for the Paul Pounders. Your dogs are spoiled. Yep. Let me go get a plate and call this good. Puppy dog burgers. Oh, hell, what am I gonna do now? Fell in there. Why, they're dogs, I'm gonna dig it out. Look at our unscathed. All right, let's go build some burgers. All right, guys, I'm gonna show you how to make the best burger the proper way. First thing you want to do is get you some mustard. Put it on the bottom bun. When you take a bite out of food, there's an order in which you taste things. Make sure that the mustard is spread to the entire bun. Otherwise, do not pass go, do not collect a cheeseburger. All right, next thing we're going to do is we're going to get this meat and put her on the bun. Burgers are kind of small. <laughs> I know they're gonna be good though. Now, we take the top bun. We put real mayonnaise on there. Now, you can put Miracle Whip, but I like real mayonnaise on a burger. Don't put a ton. Same thing. Spread it all over the bun. Then, we're going to take some good crisp lettuce. Yeah, crisp enough. We're going to put it over that. Get some pickles. Now I do not like pickles on a McDonald's. Well, I don't like McDonald's at all anyway, but I do not like them on a restaurant burger. But I will put them on my own burgers. We're gonna put them pickles right there, just a couple. You can put as many as you want. Alright. I am making two burgers. I know I ain't gonna be able to eat them. I'm just not that hungry. Then I have a pre-sliced onion. Put raw onion on there. Don't put no stinking cooked onion. Ugh. Put that right on there. Build it up. Slice by meters. Then next, this is important. Ketchup on the meat. Man, we are ready to build some burgers. Look at them dudes. Oh, look at them dudes. Here. Three inches tall. I've made them bigger, but them's good. Burger. Happy trails. You guys didn't think I was going to end the video without giving a little butt sniffers or hamburgers, did you? Got cheeseburgers. Rooster. Rooster. Got cheeseburgers. Yeah, I got yours cut up because you're little. Cheeseburger. Ooh. Yours is cut up. It's a cheeseburger. Rare. You want a cheeseburger? Come on, Lily. He's got his cheeseburger. Get your cheeseburger. Yeah. Who we got over here? 
We got a cheeseburger recipient over here. Come here, Lily. Libby. Come here. You didn't even finish your supper. You want this cheeseburger? Oh, I dropped it in the dirt. You would have put it there anyway. Eat your cheeseburger. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed the... Uh watching me make cheeseburgers. I could only eat one, they were too big, and uh, I'll eat the other one later. Man, they was big and greasy and messy. I loved them, but I stayed pretty clean. Thanks for watching, folks. Please subscribe and give me a like if you like my channel. Happy trails.